North Korea is reportedly open to discussing denuclearization with the U.S., yet the rogue regime remains silent on the possible meeting between President Donald Trump and Kim Jong-un and is literally building monuments to its missile program. North Korea is constructing a monument at the launch site for the successful WA-15 intercontinental ballistic missile test on November 28, 2017, according to Dave Schmurler, a research associate and respected geolocation expert in the James Martin Center for Non-Proliferation Studies at the Middlebury Institute for International Studies. After the successful launch of the new type ICBM WA-15, North Korean state media reported, Kim Jong-un declared with pride that now we have finally realized the great historic cause of completing the state nuclear force, believed to be able to deliver a nuclear payload to most, if not all, of the U.S. Mainland, the WA-15 ICBM is the most powerful weapon in Kim Jong-un's nuclear arsenal. In the wake of the November 28 test, Schmirler noticed additional construction at the test site. The North began constructing a monument to memorialize its weapons test in mid-February, and as of Sunday, it appeared to be near completion. This discovery led Schmirler to take another look at the test site for the WA-14 ICBM test on July 4, 2017, and sure enough, another monument was present. The monuments suggest an ongoing effort by the government to memorialize the event, Schmirler wrote in an arms control wonk post. Missile launches clearly mean a lot to the North Koreans. The construction of monuments commemorating milestone achievements in North Korea's weapons development program suggests that Kim Jong-un is not merely developing weapons as bargaining chips to be traded away for a meeting with the U.S. and raises a lot of questions about the North's reported offer to meet with the U.S. to discuss denuclearization. Despite South Korea's insistence that North Korea is ready to talk seriously about denuclearization, Pyongyang has not yet given any indication that it is ready to do so. North Korean state media has instead been running reports asserting that the North will never back down in the face of U.S. hostility and arguing that its nuclear weapons program is justified. Trump, paraphrasing the message from South Korea, said Saturday that North Korea wants to denuke, but the rogue regime's behavior certainly seems to suggest that Pyongyang has other intentions. Also watch, North Korea sentences Trump to death follow Ryan on Twitter send tips to, via email protected, dailycallernewsfoundation.org. Content created by the Daily Caller News Foundation is available without charge to any eligible news publisher that can provide a large audience. For licensing opportunities of our original content, please contact via email protected. Tags, Donald Trump, Kim Jong-un, North Korea, South Korea.